Logical variables take the values of 1 for true and 0 for false. Let's have a quick look at the logical operators. Most of them are what you would expect. We have greater than and less than. Greater than or equal to is a greater than sign followed by an equal sign. Less than or equal to. Equal to is a double equal sign. It's easy to get that one wrong. A double equal sign is a logical operator. A single equal sign is an assignment operator. Not equal to is a tilde followed by an equal sign. There are also AND operators, OR operators, and a NOT operator. I haven't used any AND or OR operators in this course, so I guess you won't need them either. Let's write some logical expressions in MATLAB. We can write some simple logical expressions. We can assign P. Uh, the uh, value 0 less than 1. So p then is a logical variable which takes the value of 1 because 0 is less than 1. We can assign q the value 0 is greater than 1. Then q is a logical variable which takes the value of 0 because um, 0 is, greater, is not greater than 1. That's a false statement. So these logical variables we can compute with, for instance, we can say p times the number 5. That will be a number which will be 1 times 5. So sometimes it's very convenient to be able to compute with the logical variables. We can also have uh, logicals working with arrays, we can assign x, say, equal to uh, 0, 1, 2, 0, a row vector. And we can assign y equal to 0, 2, 4, 0, another row vector. Then we can ask, uh, is x equal to y as a logical expression? And it will uh, generate then a um, row matrix, which will compare 0 is 0 equal to 0 in the first element. That gets the value of 1. Is 1 equal to 2 or is 2 equal to 4 in the second and third elements? That gets the values of 0. And is 0 equal to 0 in the fourth element? That gets the value of 1. Um, I've been using parentheses such as 10 divided by 2. Is that equal to 5? It is, so that gets the value of 1. But you might see this without parentheses, 10 divided by 2 equal to 5. So the logical operators have lower priority than the arithmetic operators. So what you do here is first you do 10 divided by 2, and then you test whether it's equal to 5, and that is also true. But it never hurts to add parentheses, and personally, I always prefer to put in uh, too many parentheses to make the expressions as clear as possible. Logicals are used in conditional statements, which can change the flow of a program. So that's what we'll look at next. I'm Jeff Chasnov. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.